On a sliver of land just outside Green Bay stand the ruins of a long abandoned lighthouse. Hard to imagine now, but once upon a time, this empty land was a home. A home for two Wisconsin boys named Cletus and Ralph Weber. Their father, assistant keeper Andrew Weber and mother Alice moved into Longtail Point Lighthouse in 1910. They found the sturdy clapboard house with attached tower an ideal spot to raise a family. The Weber family, Cletus, Ralph, and baby sister Adris lived in Green Bay, but spent their summer months on Longtail Point. The Webbers lived in the 1859 lighthouse, but the remains of the old lighthouse, built over a decade earlier, still lay scattered about the island, making it a fitting home for adventures. In 1980, Cletus and Ralph Weber, now adults, reminisced about their childhood adventures at Longtail Point. Born in Green Bay in 1913 and moved out to the lighthouse when I was three weeks old. My dad was a lighthouse skipper at Longtail. I was born in 1915. Though only youngsters, Ralph and Cletus pitched in to keep the lighthouse grounds running. I could have a typical day as I had my work to do, take care of the crab boxes and uh, help mother in the garden. Whatever we could do, we were obligated to do. But when the work was done, the boys would escape into the island's 434-acre wonderland. Go swimming, fool around, fall the earth, hunt ducks. We went swimming maybe five, six times a day. There was nobody around to bother us, just the two of us. Summers spent wandering the beach, catching fireflies, digging for arrowheads, and of course, fishing. We eat fish that come out of our ears. For these brothers, Longtail Point made for an idyllic childhood, an experience they would carry with them for a lifetime. Both brothers would grow up to have long careers on the water, Cletus as a sea scout and Ralph as a captain. The lighthouse that was home to the Webbers no longer stands. Reeds and bulrushes have reclaimed the island. All that remains is the long abandoned stone tower, a silent monument to the families who worked and played in its shadow. <laughs>